In February is Hit and Run Awareness Month, and the Florida Highway Patrol has a very clear message to all drivers involved in accidents. Stay on the scene. CBS 4's Peter Dench is live in Sweetwater with their message. Peter. Well, Maribel Troopy Commander Major Chris Della Petra says one out of every four accidents in Florida involves a hit and run driver, and he calls that an epidemic. He also says that epidemic continues. Miami Dade County leads the state in hit and run accidents, and this morning we heard from some victims and their families. It's done a lot of damage. It meant that was my firstborn, and it's like one half of me is just gone now. The other half, I'm really functioning. It left such a great dent in our hearts. Maggie Boykins lost her 45-year-old son, Montage, after a hit-and-run accident last September, in which he was struck while outside his vehicle. It's not good to do that. You know, you did something that was wrong. Christopher and Meredith Tunez were hospitalized for a month with broken bones and their three children injured after FHP says a hit and run driver struck their vehicle on State Road 826. You know, my kids could have died. You guys saw them up here full of life, you know, making a making a scene while we're trying to do this uh, press conference. And, um, you know, that, you know, I, we could have been short one kid. You know, and the driver had no idea um, what happened. So, you know, just staying on the scene and, and giving, helping the family get closure, really you can't put a price on that. We are so grateful and we are so thankful that we are all still alive and that our children are all still alive. Um, that it was injuries instead of fatalities. Um, reckless driving, that's what... That's what caused it. During this hit and run awareness month, FHP reminds everyone to stay on the scene after an accident. We want to emphasize that leaving the scene is not a mistake. It's a crime. And people need to have conscience. Now, the hit and run driver in the Tunez case has been arrested. FHP is still looking for the driver in the Boykins case. Leaving the scene of an accident is a felony. It can mean up to five years behind bars if you're convicted and there's an injury up to 30 years in jail if somebody dies. We're live in Sweetwater, Peter Dench, CBS 4 News.